everyone, Lois here, and I thought I'd bring some recent news relating to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts if you want to upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. This week, Niantic has launched its Valentine's Day event, which ends on Monday, February 14th, 2022 at 8 p.m. local time. And this event brings a new Pokemon and its evolutions and a new form for Furfru. And we're gonna start with that new Pokemon and it's Flabebe, which of course evolves into Floret when you have 25 Flabebe candies and into Florges with 100 full baby candies and if it's your buddy and you earn 20 hearts with it and of course the versions of full baby I'm going to discuss three of them are regional while two of them can be found anywhere in the world at any time start with red full baby only being found in Europe, the Middle East, and Africa. Blue for Bebe only being found in the Asian Pacific region, which includes Japan. And yellow for Bebe appearing in the Americas from, from Canada all the way down to South America. And of course, speaking of region exclusives, Volbeat and Illamis will be spawning in the wild globally and they are available as shinies and speaking of shinies the following Pokemon besides these two I just mentioned will be available as shinies for this event Chansey, Plusle, Minin, Love Disk, Woobat, Miltank, Ondino, Amolomola, Roselia, Lickitung, of course, Red Steel, since it's the legendary raid boss that's currently in the game, with the Mega Raid boss being Mega Houndoom, Pikachu, Eevee, and Rolts. I mean, Rolts and Spinda with its heart pattern. Those are the following shinies, and these shinies can be obtained in raids in the wild whether it be through a lore module or incense or as rewards for completing field research tasks and of course you have new avatar items such as a Fobebe themed hairpin sh shirt and shorts And there are also stickers that relate to Flabebe and its forms, Furfru and its forms, Love Disc on Dino, just to name a few. And as part of a tie-in for those who, who do Battle League, the Love Cup is going on as we speak. Speaking of Flabebe, I forgot to mention, White Flabebe and Orange Flabebe can be found anywhere in any part of the world, but though they are rare, but you will be able to find one eventually on the nearby. But the evolution process is the same as if you caught a more common red, blue, and yellow flower Flabebe. Either way, you will get all the forms of Flabebe eventually. In other Pokemon news, Niantic also launched a challenge where you had to send as many gifts and as your reward for completing this challenge, which is currently ongoing as we speak, 
you get more transfer candy for for catching a lot of Pokemon, depending on what species of Pokemon you're trying to obtain. You're going to get a lot of candy, especially if you use a pineapple berry, whether it be a normal pineapple or a silver pineapple, you're going to get candy. Especially if you catch that Pokemon, that said Pokemon, if you're successful. And this weekend is Hop It Community Day. By the time this video is up, and live the community day ticket for a hop s skip and a jump away will be live in the in-game store for a dollar or equal equivalent depending on which part of the world you are in and one more thing this weekend I'll be streaming Hop It Community Day over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Adventures as I will be doing Hop It Shiny Hunting and I will also be making a video talking about this Community Day for my next installment of Pokemon Go Plays. I mean, po Plays Pokemon Go. Excuse me for getting my words mixed up, but... But in the end, it's going to be an exciting weekend. Thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Twitch, and TikTok. Remember, it's time for adventure. Also, during these times when heading out, wear a mask, whether it's a surgical mask alone or with a cloth mask on top in the form of double masking a KN95 mask or N95 mask in public indoor settings practice social distancing wash your hands carry hand sanitizer with you or use hand sanitizer that's provided to you in public but most importantly get vaccinated and boost it, and of course, stay safe, stay healthy, and together, we are finally getting through these dark times together, but we're not out of the woods just yet.